hi guys um, so today I will a few videos ago I mentioned how many foundations I had and it was in the IMAX haul actually and I mentioned that I had 19 foundations and that's just ridiculous so I thought I'd better start reviewing them um, so yeah today I'm going to be reviewing the Collection 2000 Perfect Finish um, Air Whip Liquid Foundation I think I mentioned this in the video before I can't really remember but yeah I'm going to be reviewing this one and oh god this one's in um, ivory which is number two um, on the back it just says air whipped liquid foundation leave skin looking flawless and airbrush to perfection medium coverage SPF 20 oil free um, this is 30ml um, it says shake well before use and I know all foundations say that but this one is definitely true you have to shake it um, today I, I normally carry this around in my school bag because it's like plastic it didn't cost quite a lot so it doesn't matter if like I lose it or it, someone steals it or um, well it does matter obviously but like it's not as much to save I carry my MAC one around with me um, just in case my skin goes really really bad and I have to do my makeup again or if I, if I like I don't know water gets chucked on me I don't know just in like um, bad cases I carry this around with me so today was one of them days obviously I didn't get water chucked on me but my makeup kind of had slid and I had, I had a bit of time at lunch so and my friend wanted to do her makeup so I thought why not I'll just do mine with her um, so yeah I put this on and well I squeezed it out onto my face and it was like water it was literally like water running down my face and yeah it just wasn't a pretty look it was going like everywhere so like, oh no this is just dreadful and so but so you definitely need to shake if I shake it I don't know if you can hear it you probably can't yeah, but it does sound like water. Um, it's not a very thick consistency. I think I just got a text. Um, so yeah, it's got a really nice pump. The only problem is the lid always falls off on mine. Don't know why. It's got a nice lid though. Um, gets a bit messy though, as you can see, with the pump. So the pump's really nice, really really sturdy. Um, and you just squeeze it out, and that's how big one pump is. It's quite a lot. Um, this is quite pink toned. Actually it's quite actually it's quite yellow toned. So if I it's it like there's quite a lot in one pump that you get. And I would say medium coverage is, is right, but it's definitely buildable. Definitely, definitely buildable because we all know that I like a full coverage and it's definitely buildable. Um their other foundation, the lasting perfection, I think it's called. I did have that one and I gave it to a friend because I really really didn't like it. But um this one, yeah, I really like. I might try out the other one though, because there's loads of reviews on that one saying it's really good. So yeah, might try it back out. But yeah, this one is really, really good. So you can obviously can't see because it's foundation. I've just put it all over my hand, which was one pump and it covered the whole of this palm by hand, which is quite good. So yeah, you can see if I compare them, it's covered up like the veins. So you can't really like if you look at both hands, it's covered up the veins, you can't see them as much. And yeah, it just covered up a bit of redness that I had on my hands. Um so yeah, I really like this foundation. I do not know how much it is, but I will like put a little annotation just here. Um to tell you how much it is because I was stupid and didn't research that before I put on this video. Um so yeah. I would definitely say that this is a good foundation. It is medium coverage, but very buildable and but can be sheared out if you wanted to use like a like a damp sponge or something um with it. Um it can be get in super drugs and boot stores and they usually have like deals and collection two pound for three for three for two. So yeah. And yeah, I just really really like it. It's a good foundation for like I haven't tried it like throughout the day, but from lunchtime, which is one o'clock, um until about half four, this lasted. So it was about like I don't know, but yeah, so it was like that long. So, yeah, so that lasted like that long and I thought that was quite good. I've changed my makeup now because I'm about to go to dance and need to change it and blah, 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 blah. But, um, yeah, I was really, really pleased with this and, yeah, it was kind of a, kind of like a, a quick grab off the shelf for three for two and just chuck it in your back. But, you know, I really like this and I'm glad I bought it. So, if you need a new foundation or want to just try out a new one, um, then go and grab this one. Perfect Finish Foundation by Collection 2000. So yeah. Oh, it's also got SPF 20 in it, by the way. 
So yeah, thank you for watching. You probably find a lot of these foundation reviews coming up on my channel now because I think I'm going to do a bit of a series with them. Um, I said that with my top 10 thing, which is still going on. I'm just kind of like, you know. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so I will speak to you all soon, guys. Um, and I'm going to try and make these videos quite short with the foundation reviews. And yeah, so let me know if you want any requests or anything. And yeah, leave me in the comments below. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe. Bye.